weeks into these regular sessions and I remember this session in particular because this would be ultimately the session that would change how we viewed our training from then on. We were out um, in Albury, the place where we'd normally train. And at one point, even talking up this whole discussion of a parkour team, and because we'd been training quite a lot, it just made sense that we would become this trio team. But we didn't have any name whatsoever. My goal's a little bit ahead. I remember this. He was going through his bag, and then he just stands up, and he says to us, why don't I just call it Team Dem? The D standing for David, the E standing for Ethan, and the M standing for Michael. And the fact he just came up with that out of nowhere... And so from that day forward, we just called ourselves Team Dem. And at that point, that cemented it to me that it was like it was meant to be, you know, three family members in this parkour team making... At this point, we hadn't filmed our first video yet, mainly because we had to essentially find places to film and we had to make it a good first video. I, it gets me sort of emotional because it's like not many families would do that you know, start up our core team together, let alone, like, do this thing together. But it's something that I am always going to be forever grateful that it happened. And, yeah, so slowly but surely, we started to put together this first video. Um, and it was something like Team Dem 2013, I think. Had we not come up with the name Team Team Dem, we would have been something like I I can't imagine what other name we would have come up with, but Team Dem was just the name I'm glad we chose. In 2013, I was still making my silly day chat videos, you know, being hyper on camera, going, you know, all that silly stuff I was still doing. And posting them to Facebook specifically, I still remember I just post them on my page. And then at one point, I remember one of my friends said, you should post them on YouTube. And then someone else also said the same thing. So you should put them on YouTube. I was thinking about it. So like, YouTube isn't, I know I watch YouTube, but I've never thought of uploading them. So at one point, I just click sign up to Google. And then you, you make an email address. You fill in all the boring information and then create YouTube channel. <sighs> On the 20th of May 2013, I made my first YouTube channel, and it was just called David France. You can't go wrong with using your own name as a YouTube channel. Back then, YouTube was a completely different landscape. It was more silly videos, so I was in the right era for my kind of content at the time. I used to just make silly Dave chat videos. I still have this one memory in particular with school. Especially when I started to upload them to YouTube, more people would share them around. And I remember hearing from some people that a teacher, at it, it was like at the end of a lesson, someone was like, hey sir, you should put um, David's video on. It's like, okay. So they put it on and I got told from a bunch of people, hey David, we just watch your video in class. And I'm just thinking, uh... Uh, I just kind of froze up, so I was like, okay, um, <laughs> and that was like the first time that through posting it on YouTube, more people I knew would watch them, um, <laughs> so it was su super surreal really, although as I say they never got a lot of views, it was mainly just the people around me that used to watch them. Now I have to talk about my first series I ever made on YouTube, my first like videos at the time was a series called Dave Chat. I don't know, looking back, I don't know why I called it Dave Chat. Well, that's why I decided to name it, and it was very much inspired by the, I think it was the most popular YouTuber at the time, Fred. The high pitch, hey, it's Fred. <laughs> hey, it's Fred, and I need to go grocery shopping. I don't really know what to get because my mom gave me a grocery list, but I ate it because I was hungry, so I guess I'm going to have to wing it. <laughs> Fred, oh, Dave, it's Fred, and I need to go grocery shopping.
and very much inspired by other YouTubers like KSI at the time and a bunch of those ones that would make like sketches and things. So I felt like, oh, I'm going to try this. And let's just say it was just bizarre looking back. And I, I, was, I'm, I have to ask myself, was I taking drugs? <laughs> so enjoy this montage of these old videos. I don't have any more, but enjoy whatever it is that I have. Uh, a mental a mental asylum still open because I think I need to go in one. <laughs> Yo, get on the case. Hey guys, it's Dave here from Dave Chat Studios. Not really, it's just my living room. Oh well. And today's top story is what you're eating in your food. Is it this? Or is it that? The first one was the following. Horse meat hair. Well, in horse meat, apparently it can make you really ill, like when you get food poisoning. Anyway, I've got a good show for you this week. I've got my top ten fails of the week. And my new song. And weather and news. So, I hope you'll enjoy it, hey? So, let's go on to the news. And this is why old people shouldn't walk dogs. Isn't that funny? I laugh every time. Shh, don't let the presenters know that. <laughs> no, you do not laugh. That's all from the news so far from the Our Leader Updates. We'll have more soon. Over to the weather with Winnie the Pooh. Today's weather will be snowy with the chat with a chance of meatballs and sunny with a chance of thunder, snow, hail and rain. Well, that's all with the weather today. Over to Dave. Give it up for Dave. Hello. Well, I hope you're enjoying the show so far. I've got plenty more coming up, so I hope you'll enjoy. I'm going off the stage now, ladies and, uh, trannies. <laughs> so I hope you're ready. E e for my top ten fails of the week. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you had a laugh. Well, it's time for my song, don't you think? Don't you think? Don't you think? It's not just gonna be me, by the way. I've got some good people involved, okay? Actual singers. So, I hope you'll enjoy. My name's Dave, I have a good life. I want Taylor Swift to be my wife. Here's a few words that she said as soon as I entered the room. She knew I was. I didn't care anyway. I walked over and I had to say, You look. I'm sexy and I know it. So, yeah, you look really sexy with those tracks. Make me go on browsers.com. Yay, I love it a lot when you're playing in your cart. So, it says DJ Turn Up. The Cause I need you to be my wife, hey, turn up. Turn up the music. I said it out louder, turn up. Turn up the music. You do it in my bed. Oh, 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 oh. My penis shines bright like a. Like a oh, na na. Oh, na na. Everybody loves to look at my body. They say I'm so sexy. They say I'm so horny. When I touch you, my penis gets in balance. Oh baby, you're a challenge. Let's explore your talent. 
Hey girl, or do you wanna touch your thing? Could you make me stiff? Oh no 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 no. Hey boy, you're really hairy. You look like Mariah Carey. Oh whoa whoa whoa. Oh whoa whoa whoa. Hey boy. Boom chicka boom chicka boom chicka boom. Bitch Winnie the Pooh with his time to rap. Everybody says, Oh wait, it's crap. They say it's a sap, but it's time to go. Everybody knows, Winnie Pooh, you're Winnie Pooh, you're a hoe. My name is Winnie. People think I'm skinny, but wait, I'm fat. I look like twat. I look like an ogre. In over, I like to go to clover. Oh yeah, I can rap. Oh yeah, you'll call me a sap. I don't care anyway. I all know you are gay. To you, Dave. I'm a DJ. My name's Dave. I make the party rave. So if you want to roll with me, you gotta be Ken or Barbie. Our rape, you see, taking over. Wait now, I'll go down to Dover. Leave the French clover and get a kiss. Everybody knows. Hit, hit, hit. So I, the goat go. And I go, ow, everybody knows I bum this cow. Yeah, get down on your knees. You know that you need to please my needs. My nose, everybody knows that you get blows. I love it a lot, so get down low. Everybody knows I need a effing blow. I hope you enjoyed that because I cannot rap for poo. So, right now, let's go over to my favourite part of the show and I'll get a caller of the week. This is my favourite part of the show and I'll get a caller of the week. I wonder who will be this time. Caller, tell me what you're about. Oh, isn't that nice to hear from you? We haven't spoken for a while. I don't think we've really spoke at all, but it's nice to hear from you, Rory. He He's one of the popular kids. So, yeah, he wants all of his friends to keep in touch with him when he leaves school. Isn't that nice? Uh, bye. And remember, puberty is for 11 or 12 year old. And after this, I'm going to chop my dick off. I'm going to chop my dick off. <laughs> Wait, what? So, bye! Well, that's all I've got time for this week on Dave Chat. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope my next episode will be better than this. Thank you, and good night. And remember, puberty is for 11 or 12 year olds. Welcome to my Dave Chat Does Parkour. I started my training in a little place called Whitey. Let me take you there. Oh, Daddy. And both puberties for 11 or 12 year olds. Bye. Let me show you my happy dance. You know what this dance is? It looks gay though. Coming out all right. Hello guys and thanks for watching my Dave Chat Does Parkour. I know it's a very short video but I couldn't do that much moves because I was tired. After masturbating too hard, my foreskin ripped off and it was bleeding everywhere. Anyway, guys, if you didn't like the video, I'm going to select this box. Piss inside that to me. And you all are, and this is a joke before you all make it serious and beat me up at school tomorrow. Oh, when I'm on my own, I will select this box. I'm grateful shit. You don't deserve nothing. Thanks for watching. It was a pleasure.
day chat orders out there. Well, this is um, a very new day for I haven't done one for a century last time. I did when I was at school. Yeah, very long time ago. Anyway, um, yeah, this is a show where I make you laugh and keep you positive. No miserableness here. Yeah, um, yeah, I've got a good lineup for you today. Well, you got Dave Shatner's, you know you love her. My top ten files of the week. And maybe a new song. Hmm, maybe. Or something new. I'll surprise you. It's a surprise for me here at Dave Chat. Yeah, I don't need her. Whoa. Yeah, anyway, so... Dave Jack Moose. Today we have someone doing an insane roof gap. Winnie, what are you doing? This is my show. Stupid Winnie, you know, go off, pee me off, I need to have some coffee. Lovely. Lovely. Yeah, anyway, guys, there was this really good video on the internet, it's got quite a few, it's racked up some views. Views. Yeah, he's racked up some views. This guy just some insane roof gap. As you can see, that was some insane. He ripped his trousers. <laughs> I would hope, yeah. I might go and try that. Nah. So don't go and try it, ladies and gentlemen. Or children. Um, well, that's all for, for the news at the moment. There will be some more soon. Uh... Oh god, I ain't got no clothes. Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm missing my hat. Hmm, not really feeling black today. Ah, uh, there we go. Hey, alright guys. Um, yeah. Hope you enjoyed the show. Hope you enjoyed the show so far. Oh. Well, right now, it's top 10 fails of the week. Bit of bitch bitch again. Top 10 files of the week, ding ding ding, top 10 files of the week, ding ding ding. Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, uh, top 10 files of the week. My yeah, top 10 files of the week. Let's go. <laughs> Hello, I got superpowers. Let's test. Flipping hell. Oh, that hurt my foot a bit. That's really strange. How am I doing this? Is there like anywhere I want to go I can go? Like this? Look, I'm viewing it with the camera. What? This is getting strange right the second. Why am I now? I'm in some random room. This is so strange. Let's see if I can run through this door then, because it's getting kind of cool now. Oh, cool. I just, that was just amazing. I wonder if I can jump to that and land on the bed. Shall we try, guys? <laughs> hey guys, I'm, I'm, I swear I've inherited some good power. Well, um, yes. Well, I hope you enjoyed this day chat. I know it's very short, I haven't done one in a while, but yeah. So I hope you enjoyed and have a great life. And good night. And remember, puberty is for 11 or 12 year olds. Cause I've been living life!